Because it doesn't just change the background, it also will change, like, the sound effect of, like, when you move your, like, when you move through the UI and stuff. It's pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> burr, 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 burr. Here we go, here we go. Some Symphony of the Night. Simp Honey, yeah. Simp, Simp honey. honey. Simp, comma, honey. <laughs> Simp Honey. <laughs> Bam! All right, bigger screen now. Here we go. Let's get this out of the way. All right. It'd be useful if I could stop sucking ass. There we go. <laughs> no. All right, let's go up. Yeah, up. That's right, you can't kill the stone skulls, can you? I think you can soul steal the shit out of them, though. <clears throat> yeah, dude. I don't even have Twitch open without this shit. Alright, come on. Are you streaming? Okay, you are. Yeah. Does you know a where to get the Chrysogram? I don't. Oh, yeah, when you hit the um, thing with the holy water, the skull, yeah. the skull with the holy water. I. Uh, that's one of those ones. Right. There it is. Let's go in the yellow zone. Where is. Hmm. Bringing up my Twitters here, real quick. So, ba -ba 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 -ba. there we go. Ba -ba 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 -ba. <laughs> bitches. <laughs> bitches, granddad. <laughs> oh, man. What do we got in here? Alright. Alright, so where is the Chrysogram? The library. Oh, okay. So not in here with the little. If not that far away. We just gotta go a little higher. This guy's got bouncy bones. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. God damn it. <sighs> this is annoying. Does two damage, but like throws me. Like it has like yeah. a crazy stagger effect on it <laughs> from across the map. He's just yeah. like, hey, fuck you. <laughs> yeah, the jack of bones is like super annoying. Let's kill him from down here. There we go. Wait, do these just keep going into infinity? What's going on? There we go. Annoying. <laughs> 32 damage from a random stone skull. Hell yeah. That makes sense. Oh, 
Oh, Jack of Bones is back. Alright, I'll ask you about the tragedy. <laughs> yeah, about when I drank your coke, huh? And the monster? Oh, hold on, hold on just a second. Mm. You drank both of them, dude? Oh, you did say that you've been having problems with energy drinks. Look at that. Crush it on your forehead. <laughs> like a man. Cool. Um, I drank her Coke this morning because I needed something to uh, you know, take my pills with. To did... wash this down. Yeah. And so... <laughs> to wash down that fucking uh, Big Kahuna burger. Yeah, so, so I just... <laughs> Mmm, mmm, <laughs> that is a tasty burger. So I, um, uh, had, um, you know, a, a swig of it, and it was flat. So I was like, alright, well, you know, I'm just gonna finish this because she doesn't, you know, she's not gonna drink this flat shit, you know? And I told her about it, and she's, she's fucking furious about it, you know? She's, she's so mad. She thinks, like... That it wasn't flat or something, that I'm lying to her, that I just drank her coke. You tried to make her feel better. It's like, really, I did you a service. Like, yeah. like when people, <laughs> like when a king has someone eat something first to test if it's poisoned. Yeah. Is the Chris uh, Grimm yeah. along the top here, or do I have to go it's down? The, the, sh the schmooze carry it, so those flying heads. So you oh. should go to the left and, um... I just gotta farm that schmoo. Yeah, go to the left side there, through back through the door into that okay. hallway. This way? Yeah. And when you come down here, that one will always be flying towards you, so you can basically just, like, pop in, kill it, and then go back out, and then just keep doing that back and forth, and it'll respawn it. So you come back out, it flies towards you, and then you can kill it, and then just keep doing that. Uh. Actually, this weapon that you're using is probably one of the better weapons for doing this, because it hits really fast. I don't seem to be. Hitting. Might be able to get to the edge. That's weird. How'd you hit the first one? There we go. Got that one. So you don't want it to like drop the stupid thing and then walk out because I've had that happen to me before. And this is going to be the whole stream, everybody. <laughs> Waiting for a random drop on a on a schmoo. <laughs> would have been funny if you got it though like in the first 10 or something <laughs> like, <laughs> i've had it take forever for me to get like that like that time i got two ps5s yeah like that <laughs> time you got two ps5s and back-to-back -back drops yeah <laughs> there we go do 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 do, do, do. This is my favorite music for, for yeah. this game. They had good music, and then they went to the inverted castle, and they really kicked it up. Yeah. Come on, Shmoo. How long does this normally take? Uh, not very. As long as you're killing them pretty fast, it usually won't take that long. Where's my money, man? There's your money. <laughs> Drop 50 bucks right as you <laughs> ask that. <laughs> Where's my money, man? It can also drop. I think this also drops ramen. Ramen? <laughs> I think. The, the I ghost think is two... just carrying around some ramen. Yeah, I think it has two drops, and it drops the best sword in the game, and also ramen. Come on, Shmoo. And those lion dudes drop the fist of Tulkus. The fist of what? Tulkus. T U L K S. I guess I'll take the money. I guess I'll take the money. Ooh, a hundred bucks. Ooh, Do I have, I'm gonna see if I have something that can, like, increase my luck. The Ring of Arcana what you would be looking for. I don't think I have that one. That's because it's in 
the alchemy lab, the inverse one. Uh, well, all right then. Let's see. You definitely uh, don't have that. Or you haven't been there. You're like just. I don't have a luck potion. Thought I might, but I do not. Cheese, though. Ugh. Yeah, I got the cheese. Uh, there will be retribution, she says. Retribution. Uh, man, I told her. I told her the coke was like. You know, that was just me kind of falling on that sword for her. You know. Bro. Yeah. You know, I'm just trying to help help my wife out. You should. You should thank me. Oh, there it is. Hey, hey, that didn't take that long. Oh yeah, the, yeah. There, I forgot there was a fucking trophy for that. Yeah. Um. Um. Oh, my my sister's and now, calling me. Hold on. Hold on. Ask her if the bathroom's done yet. Yeah. Hey, Brittany, I got I got Jordan here, and he's got a question for you. Oh, okay. All right. Let's hear it. He he wants to know, uh, is is the bathroom done? Oh, I finished it yesterday. <laughs> We talked about this. <laughs> Wasn't that her answer the last time we asked about he's, it? He's starting to suspect that you're not telling him the truth, Brittany. <laughs> what? Why don't you her go down there, the water, Her, her answer is always going to be, I finished it yesterday. He'll, he'll, <laughs> no matter. he'll be convinced. Yeah? Yeah. Alright, I'm going to take you off speakerphone. Hold on. Alright, what's up? I grilled some burgers and I already fed them. There's an extra one if you want one. Cool. Yeah. Thank you. Alright, we'll see you soon. Okay. Alright. Bye bye. Bye bye. So, uh, yeah. I, um. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. Yeah. The, uh. Um. The thing with the monster right so you know i fall on the sword for her you know for this you can't be calling streamers whores in here come on i'm gonna have to <laughs> time you out for that <laughs> so you know i fall oh, on that sword for her you. he is a, he is a whore i wouldn't do that though if you're just if you're spitting the truth yeah so i fall on that sword but the monster is uh, uh it's a fee it's my fee because that she's been taking stuff to work for lunch like leftovers and like little tupperware things and then she brings them home sets them next to the sink and then doesn't um you know dispose of them so this morning I took care of the stuff from dinner last night. I took care of a bunch of her Tupperware things. It was a bunch of just really spoiled, shitty, disgusting food. So I took uh, I took a monster as my fee. That was my. She had three of them. Nah, I mean, nah, I mean. Yeah. Is there a rebuttal from? Uh, prosecutor. <laughs> Goodbye, Yellow Brick Road. Yep. What's that trophy? There's, there's three enemies in this area named after the uh, characters. Uh, oh. So, I think it's like you kill each one and you get that trophy. Hmm. So, now that you have the Chrysogram, the game's basically over. <laughs> <laughs> the game is basically just a been, walking like, simulator. You've, yeah, you've struggled here and there up to this point, but now that you... So, like, a lot of times I'll skip out on getting the Chrysogram because I just want the game to... I mean, the game's not going to challenge me really anyway, but... <laughs> I still want it to not be like that easy. Chrisogram, Chrisogram. Go get yourself a Bwaka knife. A Bwaka! I think when, when Sweeney plays next, if he hasn't already got the Chrisogram, I'm gonna tell him how to get it. Should. Yeah. A 
monster Waka moment nice. doesn't matter to her as much, but the coke is like, that's, that's... Yeah, that's kind of her. Coke, her Coke's sacred to her, so... Yeah, Dude, I'm, drink, I'm drinking a coke energy right now. You said the coke energy drinks are decent, right? They are, yeah. I don't. I I can't remember if she said she tried those. I don't. I bought. I bought her one. Did she like it? Up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Okay. I mean, it's not. It's not as good as Coke because they're. I mean, it's an energy drink, so it's like a little off, but it mostly tastes like Coke. Yeah. I don't. I feel like it doesn't go flat as fast as Coke, though. Well, that's good. Which I think might just be because, <laughs> because of the, uh... You take a shower! You hear her over here? You see this? You see this shit? You see that? Mist could pass. Just, just run a soap bar up it like a fucking credit card. <laughs> Dude, wash it, washing your butthole is gay, remember? <laughs> oh, that's right, it is! Yeah, so, apparently. I mean, so, really, that's why his butthole's so dirty, because he's not... Apparently. It's doing that scan line thing again. Hold on. I'm trying to figure out why it in does this game, that. though? Yeah, it's doing I don't, it again. I don't huh? see it, but it only does it once in a while when you do something yeah. specific. Uh, change into bat form, is that what did it? Or miss maybe. Hold on, I'm gonna reset the thing. I fixed it last night. I'm trying to remember how I did it last night. Um, properties. Um, device default custom. And then I switched it back to device default. That should fix it. And if it doesn't, we'll just fucking live with it. Do 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 do. I thought they would... Was I going the wrong way? I... Oh, this is where you would have fought the demon. Okay, apparently there's nothing here, so... What was the ring I picked up in down here? I wasn't even paying attention. It was like a special... Starolite strengthens power of cross. Uh, so that's specifically for that item. Yeah. Upside down castle. <laughs> Blocker. <laughs> the hell? Weird. I've never seen that before. <laughs> what do we got here? Battle air. Battle air. Yeah. <laughs> I thought the Chrysogrim had a special ability too. I guess it doesn't. No. It's just I don't think it really needs one. No, it doesn't. It's just an agent of chaos. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> it's such a weird thing that like it is basically the best weapon in the game. They could have probably cut its its like attack power down to like 20% of what it is. And it would still be really game. good. It'd still be really good, but it's also very strong damage-wise. Yeah. Like, there's really no bosses that can even stand up to this thing now. No. Waka! Christopher Waka here, and I've just obtained a Blocka knife! <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go out through here. We're gonna fill in this part of the map over here. Fuck you, Shmoo.
little bastard. Forgot to do the upper part. They just decided not to put anything in this room. They're like, eh, fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> we already gave him a Chrysogram. What else does he want? demon doing? I haven't even checked on his like leveling progression. He's like level 17, everything else is I think I want to yeah. I think I want to level the sword. The sword, yeah. Right, so yeah. He probably does want you to get her a goddamn coke. Are you worthy to wield me? What? Sure, man. Jeez. Uh, he probably wants No, we don't have any more coke. I can beat that skull, dude. <laughs> I can break that skull. <laughs> What's this? Where does this go? Uh, I should I should finish the outer wall before I go in and fight the Frankenstein. Just mother your children, zero respect. <laughs> and she really, like, pours it on thick, huh? <laughs> she really, she really, uh, tries to... She laying down that shit thick like whole milk. She really throws out some fucking, uh, hammers. Yeah. Oh, I don't want to do that one yet. Let's go. Let's try I'm trying to remember, remember what the guy. I was. <clears throat> I had to go pick up pre orders today, and, uh. I had two separate stores I had to go to to get them, because I moved one to a different store. Yeah. And, uh, I went to the first store, the one on the GameStop over in Auburn, and I'm getting Returnal there, and as I'm buying it, the kid, the guy behind there goes, Oh, and just so you know, we've got Elite Trainer boxes currently. So he busts a size me up and been like, yeah, this nerd collects Pokemon cards. <laughs> <laughs> but, because I can't remember going in there asking about Pokemon cards at any point. Yeah. So, I don't know. He just, he might have just asked because generally people just, uh, are seeking Pokemon cards all the time now. Yeah. Um, but I had just bought a booster box of the current set, which was like a lot of money, and also an elite trainer box for it. And it was like the worst pull experience I've had. Like yeah. I pulled like nothing out of it. And I was like, yeah, I'm pretty much done with this set. But anyway, I was like, I was like, ah, you know, yeah, go ahead and get. Yeah, I'll I'll take it because it was a little bit cheaper. They were selling it for like forty bucks. Okay. They were selling it for like forty bucks. And I was like, yeah, okay. And he was like, I mean, some people will like open the cards in the store here, and it they think it gives them more luck. And I was like, all right, well, I'll do that. And so like I I got my pre order in my in the box, and I, I moved to the next register over. And I was opening them, and the, you know they're both talking to me, like him and the other guy are talking to me. We were talking about like the PS5 and stuff, because the guy in there before I got the system was telling me about the controller and shit, and was like, "Dude, it's like the the greatest, it's like the best controller you'll ever have." And now I've played like Astro's Playroom, and I'm like, "This is the coolest thing ever." But I pulled 
uh, I was opening those packs, and you get like eight in a trainer box. Yeah. It's just uh, eight booster packs or something, and it comes with like other shit, like tokens and card sleeves and shit. But I opened them, and I'm opening, them, and like for the most part, I wasn't getting anything. Like I got like I think a V Max card in there, which is not bad, but it doesn't really matter. But then in the last pack, I got a secret rare trainer card. And the kid looked it up for me, and the card is worth fifty dollars. Whoa! <laughs> so like, I pulled, I made money on that box. Wow! Because I spent forty bucks on that box, and I got a fifty dollar card plus whatever the other ones are worth. Yeah. That card by itself was fifty bucks, but I was like, okay, so just the fact that I pulled this one card kind of made up for the rest of the experience being shitty. <laughs> the booster boxes and everything, like that one card was uh, definitely worth it. It's a beautiful card. Yeah. Like, I don't know if you've seen, like, how the artwork on recent Pokemon cards are. Well, I say recent, it's like the last 10 years, but the cards are, like, absolutely gorgeous. Because they do, like, the full art cards. Yeah. So that was my GameStop experience today. Nice. And then I went to the other place and I got a uh, Pokemon Snap. Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. Everyone's been talking about that, the new Pokemon Snap. Yeah, it came out today. Yeah. So I haven't I haven't played it yet, but I'm uh, I should pop it in. I've been playing Pokemon Let's Go on my Switch a little bit here and there. And uh, I've been playing I've been getting back into Pokemon Go on the phone, which gets me outside. Yeah. Which I mean, when it's not raining, I mean, it's raining right now. <laughs> the worst part about games like <laughs> like Pokemon Go, part of what makes me quit it, and kind of part of the same thing with uh, Brave Exvius, what made me quit it was that you get so many units, like you get Pokemon or units, that managing them becomes just a daunting task. Like, you yeah. have to go through the whole process of, like, consolidating them down and everything, and I'm just like, I don't want to fucking do this. <laughs> like, I don't want to go through and mulch all my Pokemon right now, man. <laughs> Just mulching them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. I just don't want to do that. It's just not fucking fun. Yeah. I just wish that it was, like, easier. Like, I, like, man, especially in Brave Exvius, dude. Like, I have... I think currently I'm sitting on like 1700 units or something and my max is probably around 14 or 1500 because like you can keep pulling above your maximum but then once you uh, yeah. once you want to like go do something like do a, a you know a mission or something like that they'll tell you oh you have too many units so they'll just let you keep pulling them and I'm just like okay cuz I would save up all my like resources my tickets and all that shit and i would then i i had like one huge like pulling spree where then eventually i i was like hundreds of units over my limit yeah, i was thinking about picking up pokemon snap for the kids but i don't know i you really don't let them play the Switch as often as, you know, would, that would justify, like, a new game just out of the blue right now, you know? Yeah. Like, maybe for a birthday or something, because, you know... Yeah, that makes... Something. I mean, yeah, that makes sense. And, I mean, the, the kids, for the most part, aren't like we are as a... I mean, we are as adults, where we're, like, consciously aware of, like, games coming out being the new hotness and stuff like that. So, like, you could, you could buy your kids fucking... Pokemon Snap like next year. Yeah, and they'd still be like, "Oh yeah, that's." And they'd neat. still think it's yeah, they'd still think it was awesome. And <laughs> and I mean, you said that you've been trying to uh, get a little bit for uh, getting Miles Morales, so that should probably be yeah. the next thing. Especially considering that right now you're in the doghouse over the coke. So I mean, <laughs> <laughs> probably make sure that back to the you, fucking you, coke. <laughs> probably make sure that you don't shuffle the fucking deck and then put your kid over. <laughs> You're <laughs> here on this one, man. <laughs> fucking coke. <laughs> the, be 
best part is after what we talked about yesterday or whatever, when I was saying I can get away with things, I bet I could have drank her coke and it wouldn't have mattered. You son of a bitch. I could have drank it in front of her, dude. <laughs> and I could have did one of those fucking exaggerated <laughs> at the end and would have melted her heart. Oh, I'm dead. Yes, oh, don't. Damn. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. I didn't even see how much damage he was doing to me. It was like 90 something. Yeah, those guys are like up to. Those, those guys, guys are, are like elite. the hardest enemy in the game. One of them. Those guys are elite, dude. Yeah. Oh, yeah. If you if you want to, you can fuck around and power level on those dudes because like killing two will yeah. level you like every time. Wow. Alright, I don't even remember what I was doing. Oh, I'm way back in the fucking library here. Okay. Or no, the... Yeah. Saved after this Yeah. Damn. Yeah, like, you gotta be careful on those fuckers. They're brutal. I wasn't even, like, registering them as a threat until it was too late. I was like, oh, fuck, you know, like... So I'm gonna go back up here, I think. No, it looks like I already picked up all the stuff, so I just gotta go down, right? Okay, I already got all this shit. Neat. Okay. Who's that? Who's that? Oh, it's fucking Donovan. Shit. Let's see if he wants to jump in, man. Maybe he wants to come hang out. Let him know we're in here. If he wants to pop in and hang out. Yeah. That'd be cool. Yeah. Yeah, having like uh, him and Mark in here is pretty fun. Yeah. Definitely livens up <clears throat> livens up the stream experience. <laughs> I wish that people were, were able to be in here for some of the shit we've talked about though. We've talked about some ridiculous shit in here. But yeah, people don't know what they're missing. Once once you and Mark get going on the socioeconomic like you know, realities of the Castlevania world. That's educational. That is quality <laughs> entertainment. The That's... fact that Dracula's actually providing people with, you know, a, a, a home in a workplace. Yeah. yeah like he, he's got he this massive them. castle that he's just opened up to the Transylvanian kind of countryside. What even is. is his line of business? Like, is he running a bed and breakfast? And... I don't know. Maybe he's just, like, in real estate or something. I don't know. Could be real estate, yeah, that would make sense. Maybe he's just, he's like in stocks because he's so yeah. old he can just let them mature for, you know, ridiculous amounts of time. Should I, I uh, go up into the basement area? Should I do that? Basement of, oh, the underground, like, yeah. caverns and shit? Should I do that? I mean, that's where Gallimoth is. Uh, who's that? Is he, do I want to kill him? The hardest boss in the game. Oh. That's um, where you would get the uh, poison <laughs> gas, the oh, hmm. poison gas uh, power. So I want to do other stuff you... first before I fight that guy. I mean, if you want, I can have you sidetrack briefly, and then Gallimoth will be trivial. <laughs> so you can go to the underground caverns and I can get you there. It'll be a very slight sidetrack, and then... We'll go to these guys. I don't like this area because of the little things that like clamp down on you on the yeah, floor. Yeah, they do. They do like a hundred damage. Uh, these ones are doing like forty to me right now. Okay, that's not bad. 
Oh wait, I'm thinking of the Nova Skeletons. Those guys, when they hit you with the beam, Christ, does like a hundred yeah. something damage. I mean, it's a good thing they telegraph that shit, but damn. Yeah. yeah, you can hear the sound, yeah. Yeah. I'm just gonna fly over these idiots. They ain't worth, like, decent experience anyway, so... Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Imagine a monster like that in fucking Pathfinder or something. You know, it's just this punk ass skeleton looking thing, and then it just like blasts you with a, a plasma beam or something, and you're like, what? Isn't, isn't that basically <laughs> the Catablepus? <laughs> this fuck ugly donkey ass creature that lives in a swamp and it has like a death beam. <laughs> it has a breath weapon, basically. It, 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 it hits hard as hell, doesn't it? It does, yeah. I don't I don't know if the Catalypus is particularly a high CR. I think it, it, it might be, like, mid-area, but that beam just does so much damage. Alright, so we're gonna try not to get hit by this fucking knight, dude. That's yeah, he's, he telegraphs his shit pretty pretty well too so like when he um just watch what he does i guess for a second while you're kind of out of range of him or you can just keep doing this until he dies only doing eight so he's damage, going though. to do the sword in front of him yep again. yeah he has like a hundred health the sword's fucking him up dude he's only doing I'm just gonna swing it. Get close. Oh shit! He's gonna hit you real soon. You better start hitting him with the pistol. If you can kind of keep him doing the. You can kind of keep doing the. There we go. Just spam him into fucking oblivion. <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah, if you keep doing the swing, he'll sometimes he'll just keep trying to do the shield, and if he does that, he's not trying to attack. Oh you, so. fuck! I didn't know there was oh, yeah. another one there. God damn. I should have told you that. He's just he's like blade beating like crazy. Yeah, he's gonna keep doing that because you're off screen. There you go, you got him to swing. Yeah, you just have to get used to like watching his arm movements to know like what abilities he's gonna use. Gotcha, bitch. Get you in my pink can. Yeah, if you just stand here with the shield, uh, like right in front of him, just keep hitting at him, yeah. he'll just keep putting the shield up and you'll kill him because you swing really fast. Hey, you should've got the, uh, clock for this. Clock power, so you can go in there. Oh wait, you can get it out of here. <laughs> Yay! And the holy water is obviously better, but yeah. you can just get that item in the next room. I really like this lightning one, too. That one was always kind of kind of neat. Yeah, the lightning is cool. Oh, we were going to do the clock side, weren't we? Let's do that. Some resists. Oh, there's another one of those idiots over there. Yeah. 
got this, dude. You have plenty of health. You'll get through. Oh, he guards against that. Hmm. <laughs> you know, <an> idiot. <laughs> oh, that doesn't work on him. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Ah, oh, fuck. I didn't time that right. Quit being a little bitch over there. I'm coming for you. <laughs> Can't stop me. <laughs> coming for that ass. <laughs> Nah, man, sorry. No Sonic Adventure today. Maybe next time. <laughs> I could sing you the song or something, if that'll make you feel better. Put on a little uh, escape from the city, make you feel at home. <laughs> no, no, this is Sonic Adventure 2. This is totally a Sonic Adventure 2. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Look out for that guy. He dropped something. I just don't remember what it is. It's a... Oh, ring. Sort of Hodor. <laughs> How are the plushies coming Let's along? See. She's she's hard at work in the sweatshop. Yeah, she's, <laughs> she's, got, she's got all these like needle injuries on her fingers. <laughs> it's just one guy that just whips them. <laughs> I thought there was a save point off of this room. Maybe there isn't. I get all turned around because everything's upside down. Uh. No, I can't think of one thing down here. There's the mummy down here. That's the boss you'd be fighting. I don't remember what else is down here. This idiot. This. Or here. The teleporter. Yeah. Where are we now? We're there. No, it's only gonna go between the two spots. Okay. Okay. What's down here? Another paralyzer. I'm just a birdie, too. Ooh, spikes. Spoopy. I think we're gonna switch over to some spike breaker. Oh, we are on Spike Breaker. What the hell? Weird. There must have been other spikes that I was dealing with and Yeah, I don't need the clock. 
fuck anymore. What did I from this day forward? You will call me Betty. <laughs> Random ninja star sitting in a hole. <laughs> of course, man. I must stay forward. You call me Betty. But isn't Betty a woman's name? <laughs> Come here, mummy. Oh, look at that. Wait, that's your mom? Apparently. Who even is that guy? Akmodan the second. <laughs> Who the <laughs> fuck is that guy? <laughs> Should be a room there, yeah. Bone of lad. <laughs> I got your bone of lad right here, front I man! Get I get your bone <laughs> fucking doing the double hands towards the scrub! <laughs> your bone of lad right here! <laughs> Medusa heads back at it again. Back at it again. I'm gonna change my armor though. It's kind of a fucked up creature concept, like a zombie that you hit, and it breaks the, in half. The one and the... that breaks in half, yeah. yeah. Oh, didn't mean to do the that. The thing that always kind of... I uh, One of the creepiest things in this game is when you're in the normal version of this section, and you walk by the jail cells, and those guys walk out from the darkness uh, in the cells and shake at the, uh, the bars. Yeah. Fourteen hundred kills, wow. Yeah. It's, it's a man right there. Are you sure? I mean I think. I mean that's Do you even know what a man is? <laughs> well I know that he has to be swift as the coursing river. Um with all the was it the force of a great typhoon and all the strength of a, a raging fire? Yeah. And uh mysterious as the dark side of the moon. So a, I know that's the checklist have, right there. You yeah. just gotta. They also have to be miserable. <laughs> they have to be a collection of objects, but kind of laid about uh, haphazardly, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and you have to not be generally aware of any information about them. Oh, oh shit! Where did I fall down to? Did I want to be down here? I don't even know. 
by Medusa. What the fuck? You can spike break your way through there. Yeah, that's the sniper of Goth. They're weak to dark damage. <laughs> yeah. The ra the random like one angel. The one monster. other. The, the one other <laughs> enemy in the game. <laughs> Ridiculous. Wait, is this the spike breaker side? I don't think it is, right? Yeah, go up. A little bit. Or maybe I'm wrong. I might be wrong. No. Yeah, I think I'm wrong. Anyway, I'm gonna use the bath. I guess it was Medusa. Hmm. Not bad. Doing pretty good on that stuff. Stats are looking real nice. It's a Bwaka knife! <laughs> Listen, Alakad, you got me wrong. <laughs> Fucking Donovan did it better. I'm a disgrace. Knife. Right, so this is the other one. Okay. Right, I think the only way you can connect them is, yep. Why did I turn into the dog? I'm just transforming into everything here just because. Apparently. Here we go. Boy. Boy. I got another Bwaka knife. Christopher Walken here, and now <laughs> I am dual wielding Bwaka knives. a garnet. <laughs> this is such a remote area to get to, and they're like, yeah, you get a garnet. <laughs> Block of knives. Lightning mail, that sounds cool. Makes my defense go down like hella. But it's strong against lightning. That's true, there's probably like three enemies that use lightning. Yeah. 
I gotta say, it's a totally different game with the Christogram. <laughs> yeah, isn't it? <laughs> game is just child's play when you have it. Yeah. It's cool that they attach a trophy to it, though. Yeah. Like, you probably don't have... I, you probably have to beat some of the bosses, but... There's probably not a lot that you're missing. Yeah. Right, there should be something You do have there. to, like, get, like, all of the exploration. Like, you have to get everything there. Oh, what? For, like, to platinum it? Yeah. You have to get, like, every little room yeah. done and covered on the map. I'm not too worried about that. Just having fun, man. We got here. Hmm. Blocka. Decide whether or not he wanted to. I'm going back across. <laughs> I absolutely just nuked the Medusa in here. Just annihilated her. Yeah. Like you could probably just fuck up the whole house without dying. Do, 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 do. Breaker. Christopher walking here, <laughs> and I'm throwing my blocker knife while wearing my spike breakers. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? A twilight cloak. That's the cloak that he wears, like the original cloak. That's Ooh. the best cloak in the game. Sweet. Sweet. <laughs> See, now you look cool. Yeah. Go break those. Good, isn't it? Yeah. You ever want a nice like relaxing experience kind of like bubble wrap or breaking those spikes buy yourself a paper shredder a picture <laughs> just run it through the i just, dude, I, uh, I, dude, I dropped i i i had like all these work papers i don't need and since i'm bored when i'm in the office i will do little things to try to you know pass the time and not want to kill myself yeah. And <laughs> so I had all these papers that I'm not going to need, obviously, when eventually I look for different work. I eventually need them now, but 
Um, I bought a paper shredder at Staples for like $70, and it's amazing. I love having any sort of paper that I can run through it. <laughs> <laughs> it basically just makes confetti. Yeah. Oh, you got like a diamond cut one? It cuts it into small, like, squares. Oh, it's a cross cut. Yeah. I know my paper shredders, son. Cross cut! <laughs> cross cut! <laughs> <laughs> son of a bitch! <laughs> it's back! It's never gonna be gone. <laughs> uh, no, it's awesome, though. I love I love having a paper shredder. Like, I, I'll get, like, a magazine in the mail, and I'll fucking, like rip it apart and just put it through the fucking paper shredder <laughs> instead of throwing it away. That's funny. Cross cut guys. <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> the Mormagill. You gotta get that. You gotta bust that, that the out. The one fucking weapon. <laughs> but they For put the it in they, enemy. But they put it in a room with a bunch of other enemies that are probably resistant to dark. All those little demon imps are probably resistant to dark. <laughs> yeah, they probably are, dude. Some ominous music. Misca pass. Misca pass. <laughs> we're, never, we're never gonna forget that. <laughs> it's gonna be one of the most stupid sayings that we came up with one time, and yeah. we just still, we'll still say it years later. It's funny to me how many dumb things I've said one time, and people still quote them. Yeah. And it'll, there's oftentimes things that I've said that I don't remember that somebody will quote. I'll be like, I don't even remember when I said that, but yeah, it sounds like something I'd say. Poor werewolves. I know, they look up to the heavens like, WHY?! They're <laughs> like, I'm such an idiot! How did I let this guy beat me?! <laughs> he grabs his head, he's like, fuck, I forgot! <laughs> like he forgot something. He's like, I forgot to pay my bill <laughs> before being sent back through hellfire. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> that skull you can't break that skull I can break this skull 458 HP Whew. yeah you're crushing it dude yeah.
<laughs> All that for one Zircon. Yeah, dude. Buffalo Star? Buffalo Star! That's <laughs> where that hobo was. Yeah. It's grape wine. Can I go down? Yeah, we're gonna go down. This is where I want to be. Okay. This, I think, this is where I want to be. No. Hmm. Thought there was supposed to be a boss down there. Did I fuck that up somehow? It's gonna be over here. What we got? Oh, you might recognize these fellas. <laughs> Ain't gonna be no season four for you. <laughs> got him. Trashing them. <laughs> shit get hit, you know? That's a good point. I don't think they said anything, but yeah, okay, man. <laughs> they were thinking it. <laughs> <laughs> Misky pass. Pass. Oh, shit. Almost ran into that thing. That's a lot of money, though. That's a lot of money, done. Just put an egg in a tomato and you will be amazed. That sounds awful. Like, I like both of those things and I'm I'm not sold. Yeah. I'm not sold on that shit. <laughs> and as you're aware, I hate at least one of those things. <laughs> yeah. At That's least. 50%. <laughs> That's 50%. No, I like eggs. Okay. What's over here? Or these friggin' stone skulls just bobbing about. Hey, what's this thing? Gram. Isn't the description for this just a sword called Gram? There's a sword called Gram, yeah. The sword named Gram. Yeah. Yeah, they weren't really, uh... They weren't really trying on that one. You know what weapon I haven't got? The shield rod. Yeah, it's around. I never picked that up. From the other castle. Yeah. Just like your princess. Yeah. 
I think I completely missed the whole uh, shield rock thing. Yeah, you probably still have a lot to do. Yonder. Okay. Wait, is there no, okay. See you later, idiot. this idiot? Hit your javelin. Seven dwarves riding that fucking old people stair thing. <laughs> Little boomerang. Oh, a diamond. Just wrecking these dudes. <laughs> the power of the Chrysogrim, baby. Heart max up. Some, some decent time here with this chrysogrim. Take the holy water. Nope. We're back. Oh, okay. I see what we're doing. <laughs> Alright, there we go. I wonder what my holy water damage is right now, even. Oh, maybe we'll about to find out. What the fuck? That's pretty good. Hell yeah, brother. Get him. B is the bub. B is the bub. B is the bub. Cut his fucking feet off, dude. Yeah, dude.
Ring of Arcana. That's the luck one, right? Ring of Arcana increases rare item appearance. That's cool. Are there any rare items that I even want right now? I don't even know. I, mean, I already got a Chrysogrim. What more can for I ask drops, for? drops, uh, you can get like a Lapis Lazuli, which very heavily increases your luck. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, the Moonstone's probably not doing much for you. Is it not? Let me see. I mean, the Ring of Arcana is not changing any of your stats. Yeah. So, it means that thing's not really doing much for you. Right. Ring of Arcana it is. You sold me. Gotcha. <laughs> Another sale in the bag. Let's give a <laughs> wink to my manager who's in his small <laughs> cubicle manager's office. <laughs> Watching me like a hawk to make sure I'm not fucking up. Yeah. Getting those fucking metrics and shit. Oh, yeah. Gotta get those metrics, man. Mm. I'm just a birdie too. go up this thing. It's just filled with imps and shit. There we go. The goddess shield? Sounds neat. Let's take a look here. Engraved with goddess image. Oh. It doesn't seem to change any of my stats at all. So sure, why not? another fucking imp. Damn it! Yeah, the little, the little imps are super annoying when you're in this, like, shaft. Yeah, because it's only, like, one damage that pulls you out of that form, you know? Here we go, here we go, here we go. We're getting to the top. Yay! I win again, just like always. Little gremlin idiots are kind of annoying. Hey. 
Hey. Nice. Hey. Hey. Break that wall. Then make sure you break the one above you when you get out of here. It was just 50 bucks. That's all they gave me in this room. Okay. Weird. Resist the dark. <laughs> Shaman. Get bent, Jack of Bones. Ha, <laughs> got him. Five hundred and eight HP. Hell yeah, brother. I can get it. Oh, I see on my thing that Ben followed me. Nice. It's pretty sweet. this thing. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. To go find some more mermen. Where are my mermen at? No mermen. <laughs> uh, break the walls there on the thingy. Yeah, I'm just so disappointed. No mermen. Okay, now go back up to the edge of that right side of it. Eh? Go back to that thing. What thing? The rock. The rock that you broke the holes into. This one? Yep. Sorry, it's a little delayed, so like, I'm watching- you're still in the room. Okay. Stand on the edge of it there. Now turn into a wolf.
What am I supposed to do after I turn into a wolf? Okay, now walk through it. Like th uh, left to uh, right to left. Sorry, right to left through it, through the rock. Right to left through the rock. Yeah, so like through the hole of the rock. Yeah. Now turn into a bat when you get to the edge. Okay, hold on. And then go to. All right, yeah, so, so wolf. When, so start on wolf. It's, yeah. it's a weird little thing. So start on wolf. Yeah. And then walk to the edge, the left edge. Yeah. Turn to a bat and then go back through. What was Regardless supposed to? That. What was supposed to happen? Uh, have you done it yet? It's like oh my my stream is delayed by like 15 or 20 seconds. It's so That's weird. Crazy. I'm gonna have to uh, now go up to the right side of this whole room, like up top right. Top right. Yeah, up where like the water is. Oh, there's a thing Shoot. there. Yep. What the zircon opal barrel? Yeah. Now, when you go to fight Gallimoth, you're going to equip the barrel circlet because it provides you with immunity to oh, lightning damage. Oh wow, that's pretty cool. But it's not just immunity; it absorbs lightning damage. Wow. So when he uses his lightning, he'll keep restoring you back to full health if he's done any damage to you. Wow. And you can, if you're kind of standing in front of him, he'll usually just use the lightning ability, so you can kind of just cheese it. That's crazy. You can also do that again in the other castle. <laughs> and uh, that's where you get the jewel sword. Oh, I see. The jewel sword's very good for getting money. Yeah. Fire boomerang. Fire boomerang. You know what a fire boomerang is? Do, do you know? Nope. It's a, a boomerang with fire! <laughs> with fire! I had to refresh because you were, for some reason, like 20 seconds. That's ahead of crazy. me or something like that. So you're like describing it and I'm like, you're not doing anything right now. You were just standing in place. <laughs> you're just standing there like a dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> like you're saying it as though you're doing the thing at the same time, but I'm just watching you not do anything for a while. So I'm like, just do the thing I'm telling you to do. What does the cross look like? I don't know. Oh, it's badass, actually. Uh, I don't know if I want. Do I want the cross or the holy water? I don't know which one I want. Hmm. I'll keep the holy water. I like it too much. Hundred bucks, hell yeah! Ouch. Wow, chili dogs. All right, time to go back the way I came. There's a lot of fucking Nova skeletons up in here. I 
actually, isn't there a way into the underground from here? I think there is. Nice. Hey! Back at it again. With the shit takes. The shit takes. <laughs> He's home. <laughs> Your wife just standing there with a baseball bat at the end of the, <laughs> end of the garage as the door opens. <laughs> she just drags it along the floor. The a la carte shield. Strong versus all attacks. I like that. It's just strong against everything, bro. Like, not a way down, I guess? No? Okay. What room is that really powerful dude in? Melamos like way down in the catacombs. Down where you fought the uh the big um ball of human bodies. Oh yeah, he's way down there. Yeah, he's like at the bottom. Safyun Katana. It's a katana. Oh, Japanese. Wow, it's really bad. Does it have like some sort of special ability? Oh, that's not bad. That's kind of okay. It's not. It's not complete buns. So I mean. Should take. Huh. Oh, that's annoying. How do you get up there? Uh. Yeah. Timer's still off, yeah. 
Got some jewel knuckles. Potion seller? Hello, potion seller. More jewel knuckles, sweet. Now you have jewel knuckles for your other knuckles, dude. <laughs> Shit. Fish. An upside down killer fish. Shit take. So many shit takes. <laughs> He's back. Right. Bastard. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Oh, 
kill the doppelganger, right? Yeah. You're killing things so fast now that if I switch a tab for a second, I'll miss something. <laughs> <laughs> I got a dark blade. Is that strong against holy for some reason? I don't know. Let's see. <laughs> Sword forged by elves. That's all it says. Makes sense, I guess. It has no like special ability or anything like that. That's lame. Yeah. What would be nice is if like, if there was like a, if they had like a stats thing, like you hit one button and it like has like attributes of the weapon, because those descriptions don't really, um, don't really cut it. Yeah, they don't really tell you much. Like sometimes they'll just give you like random information that doesn't help out a whole lot. Hearing the sound of the woman screaming when you kill her from your uh, yeah. controller. <laughs> I love it. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Do, 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 do. These cave trolls don't stand a chance. Force of Echo. Yeah, it makes it so the Echo does damage. That's cool. I think I know. I think I'm gonna go down to the, the hard guy. Dude, fucking destroy him. Yeah, just fucking end him. He doesn't stand a chance. You put the barrel circle on, you'll be fine.
Ben's still streaming. Playing that Path of Exile. Go into the down Wait, into the this depths. This thing keeps fucking. It keeps buffering on me. Time's up, motherfucker. <laughs> Just get real close to his ear. She's got to sneak in. She has to sneak in on you one of these times, and she just yeah. like, gets in real close on the camera, and you see her. Just see her just creeping into frame. Yeah, I just, just... see her creeping into frame. <laughs> 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 oh, I love that. <laughs> she wants me to come in, so I'm gonna. I'll go in once I. Oh, death is here. The man. Yeah, yeah. I forgot about death. <laughs> Uh, man, imagine forgetting death, the one inevitability of life. <laughs> Not while there is hey, this guy sucks. Then, for the master, I'll feast on your soul this night. Place your bets. Place your bets. Once we get to the next save point, we'll be uh, hanging it up. My wife is beckoning to me. We got some shows that we gotta watch. We're gonna watch uh, what is it? Shadow and Bone. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's that we watched uh, two episodes of it. Um, I went through last week, and we were actually pretty three. happy with it. I liked I'm gonna, it. I thought it was pretty I'm gonna good. I'm going to have to pay a little more attention, maybe, or restart it or something, but, like, I was starting to watch so, it, and I found I was kind of, like, drifting. My I attention was prepared. going elsewhere. Like, while I was watching it, like, I would, like, do something else. Yeah. And it wasn't, like, keeping me. And, I mean, I was also, like, I saw, like, on the advertisement, I was like, I think that's Ben Barnes, and I was, like, There's really, like, I like that guy Perhaps a lot, I so. Should press it. And so far, he's like the only character that interests me, so like, the main character doesn't draw me in because I don't feel like she talks a lot. The, the, the thing about that show, so far, my takeaway from the show is the main character is the least interesting thing about the show. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. That's, that's what's doing, that's the same thing for me. She is right, you did just save, and you could kill death again. <laughs> it took like two seconds. Kill death um, like 20 times. <laughs> He's like, you again? <laughs> <laughs> this fucking guy, Jesus. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's my problem, though. My main problem with it is that the main character is not that interesting to me. Like, she. They're like, oh, she's special, you know, she's the Sun Summoner and shit like that. And Sun Summoner sounds badass. Like, that sounds yeah. like a sick title yeah. and stuff. But, like, she doesn't seem... It seems like everybody talks for her. It's like she's in the room, but everybody talks about her. Yeah. Like, around her. Instead of her, like, you know, commanding a presence at yeah. all. She's not acting in her own scenes. Everyone else yeah. is kind of... And that's kind of yeah. how it is, because... So... A lot of shows and movies that are based off of, like, those young adult novels for, you know, that are geared towards, like, young women, you know, yeah, 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 they yeah, always yeah. have these protagonists that are kind of, like, flat. You know, everyone yeah. else is interesting, but was, they yeah. they do it on purpose because they want um, the, the female reader to be able to step right into the role of that character yeah. and kind of, like, live yeah. vicariously through them, so... But they're always special without it being specific as to why they're special, yeah. you know? Yeah. Ooh, the a la card sword. Yeah, dude. I mean, 
uh, you could replace the Crystal Grim if you wanted to. <laughs> All the cards uh, is pretty cool, though. It is. It is a good story. You're right, though. They do that with a lot of them. They try to get somebody who's, like, a girl who's, for some reason, like, super pretty, but she's, like, a loser for some reason. Yeah, she's... <laughs> it's, it's, like, for some reason, she's, like, bullied by both boys and girls. <laughs> <laughs> it's, like, this would never happen to this girl ever in the real world. Uh, but they always find somebody that's, like, you know, pretty, but she's also got, like, the most bland personality. Yeah. The fuck? I must have missed a save point somewhere. I, I don't know what the fuck. Happened. It was definitely. I mean, I read the Hunger Games book, and it was definitely kind of the same for that too. Yeah. A little bit. Like the characters, like hard to get into at the beginning, and actually through a good chunk of the story. But like, she kind of comes around here and there because she's just pretty. She actually is skilled because she had to learn survival skills. Yeah, so she actually has some ability to her, you know. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the other thing is, that at least the writing style of the Hunger Games is supposed to like reflect her limited uh, education, you know. Yep. So it like does, the too. whole yep. the whole writing style is yep. done yep. by someone who has kind of like a, a limited ability to write. And she also, she, like, she doesn't understand certain things based on, like, social status, basically. Like, yeah. she's lived in, like, the poor part of the poorest district. <laughs> like, yeah. it's like, it's like when, uh, oh, man, it was one of, like, uh, I think it was, uh, oh, I think it might have been Daniel Tosh. He was talking about, like, when LeBron got traded away from the Cavaliers to Miami and... Cleveland basically treated him like total shit, like he was dead to them. Did they? After leaving. Wow. Yeah. And he, and like, basically LeBron, <laughs> LeBron is from Ohio. Yeah. But he's from, uh, I guess Akron, which is like a poor part of the poor area of Ohio. Yeah. And also, like, he was from the poorest part of that poor part of that poor part of Ohio. Yeah. <laughs> 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 it's like a, there's many layers. <laughs> you dog, I heard we you liked poor things, so we just put poor within the poor. Yeah. Oh man. All right. Like so had to learn I just survival skills and shit. I just saved, so I am I am done uh, for tonight. I I will pick up some Symphony of the Night another time. Uh, I don't know who else we had uh, in here. Fantasy. Yeah, oh, or Final Fantasy. I know we had some people who popped in and out, so you know I appreciate you know those those people, and I love them, and I want them to follow me, so that I can get to that fifty. <laughs> I'm gonna have to start Soon. seeing if I can round up people that I yeah, know that haven't we, followed you. We we gotta round up some people because I'm so close. Because now that that Ty and Ben followed me yesterday, I was yesterday I was at nine, so I must be at seven or something like that now. Yeah, so, you were 41. You're yeah. 43, it says now. <laughs> so close. Yeah, we just got to round up some people. All right. So I'm going to cut the stream here, and we will we will play again another time.